Hey guys, good morning. Welcome to day three. So we're getting ready to leave right about now. So got ready, had my breakfast, ordered a green juice, which I do need to finish, uh, working on my coffee. And we are, we're doing well today. So yesterday during the pool party, I did not drink at all. And then I waited till I think it was like 3.30 or four. And then when we were hanging out at the beach, I had like a beer and then saved the rest until evening. So I'm kind of trying to like pace myself, you know, I feel like day drinking is a lot more satisfying than night drinking, but the issue is with the sun, I feel like I get way more hungover, so things are not going well for me. So, eh, yeah, gonna figure that out. But um, yeah, we took it really easy yesterday and it was so much fun. Luke Bryan is such a good performer, it's crazy. Um, he played, you know, all the best ones and we ended up leaving the crowd for um, part of his section of the concert because, so we, okay, so we were, in the front during uh, Cole Swindell and got to see all of that. And then we ended up going to the beach where we could like sit and just like watch the big screen. Sorry, Darren took a bath this morning and it's draining. So you guys are hearing some wild sounds happening in the background. That's what's going on. Um, but yeah, we went and watched the concert from the beach and it was so fun. It was a lot breezier over there in the middle of the crowd. It was actually really hot. And then um, and we're like, man, well, you know, it's Mexico, of course it's hot. And then you leave and go to the beach and you're like, oh, actually it's a bit of a chilly night. <laughs> it's just how crowded this area is. But anywho, had a great time. I did not get my churro last night, which was very disappointing, but we ate beforehand. We'd gotten room service. So um, I didn't really have the space to enjoy a churro, but you best believe tonight, I will be having a churro because our churros are really good. Um, as of right now, we're about to head to the pool. But anywho, good morning. Once again, every time I try to do a quick 10 second clip, here we are, almost five minutes in. All the plans have changed. They're drinking. They're like a mixed drink, so there's not much in it. So like, I don't feel anything, but like, we're getting after it. We're about to go to the pool party. Cheers. dealing with a bit of a seagull infestation right now, but uh, pool party's still going. It's about two hours over when it was supposed to end, but apparently Dustin Lynch is known for doing that. So that's still going on in the background. We have moved to the beach, enjoying some beer, and uh, yeah, I'm not really sure when this is gonna end, but the evening event starts.
starts at this point in about two and a half hours. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I think we just stay here until it ends and then quickly get ready. We have to iron on the shirts today and then the evening event. So I'm thinking room service for dinner because we don't have time to go to a restaurant, but we're having fun. Guys, we are ready and steady. We are taking off. I got the boots tonight and I've got the light up hat. I'm about to head over to my in-laws room and we are going to officially transfer the shirts. Um, we're gonna wear them tomorrow, I'm assuming, because at this point, We've all gotten ready. I decided. <laughs> so, anywho, that's what's going on. We've got some country music playing. I've got my little workstation. You best believe I got my Michelob Ultra. Is it Michelob? Yes, Michelob Ultra. We're ready to rock and roll. Making the shirt. Final one. Are you excited? Oh, oh my god, I'm so excited. They're so cute. Oh, yes, they, they are. are so cute. Rock she has been doing all of that. With the Look how cute all of these are turning out. Our family crafters. Yes. Starting to feel like event planner was the wrong one. I'm feeling like family crafter needed to be the family right one. Family crafter really could have been it, don't you think? But here we are. This one is mine, and it is the family event planner. And, and you it are the events, but a lot snazzier. Oh yeah. And I'm feeling Make like the maybe, maybe we ought to do something about crafting because this this is the bomb diggity. And as Miss Co-host of the crafting, can I just say, girl, you have a knack for crafting? I oh, the crafting queen. I'm so good at ironing. <laughs> We have the males, the male gender, they are all watching some kind of sporting event over here. They have no idea, they have no idea of their game, or not their games, their shirts. So we have family concierge, in-room services not included. Family muscle, camp, uh, can't ban these guns. Family wrangler, manhandling heifers since 1994. Family therapist, fixing one crisis at a time. Family promoter making everyone look good. Family Bob the Builder. You briefly mention it. I'll build it. And then, of course, of course, family event planner. Event. But, uh, but a lot. Snazzier. Yes. Woo! Gonna wait for this to cool just a wee bit. And we're gonna peel this bad boy. Have, have I taken on a southern accent? <laughs> And look at the front. WTF with the family. Yeah. In room services. <laughs> I like this. Correct. <laughs> okay, correct. Correct. That was easy. That's a good one. This one can't handle it. Yours is the can't ban these guns. Yep. Family yes. Bob the Builder. And then family Peter Promoter. Who do you think that is? That's mom. Family Promoter. That would be me. Making yes. everyone look good. Who's the family therapist? It's me. <laughs> we are getting dinner at the Italian place right now. Just ran to the bathroom real quick and we're going to have dinner and then head to the evening show. So excited, it's going to be amazing. Fit is awesome. gals are getting massages. The guys left this morning around 6 a.m. and they are all golfing. So we're all kind of having a leisurely morning. Um, we 
it's really early morning. And then um, I think we're going to the pool party today. Today's pool party was kind of the least exciting. So we might skip it, we'll see. But uh, I will see you guys at the spa. Oh my gosh, it rained this morning. I knew I was hearing things. It sounded like a bit of a tropical storm going on like an hour ago. So now everything's wet and yeah, the weather is not all that in a bag of chips. So hopefully by the time we come out of the spa, things will be good. Oh my gosh, you guys, a golf cart has taken out this light. Uh, oh, people are getting a little wild. I mean, honestly, these golf carts, like they speed up for turns. Like you're holding on for dear life. You're like almost falling out of the cart and stuff. Like I'm not surprised that they took one out, took out one of these lights. I bet they took out a lot more. <laughs> We just got to the spa. Look how beautiful this place is. And then they do have a little shop. And then they have a little coffee bar with snacks. We have all the seating around here. So we are just waiting to uh, check in for our appointment. Dylan's got I enjoyed breakfast. Yeah. Yeah. Hey guys. So it's a bit later. Came back to the room, showered. Uh, washed my hair, got ready, all of that jazz. So the spa was absolutely beautiful. And I got, I think it was called the balancing facial. So it was really good. It was a bit more aggressive than I thought. Um, I didn't realize that there were like manual extractions and this lady just like attacked my face. I mean, there was, there was nothing gentle about what was happening. And honestly, I do think I'm gonna have like bruising or red marks already. Um, I was noticing as I was like doing my makeup that things are already kind of red and kind of delicate to the touch. So um, I'm hoping that this is just like right after and maybe somehow I will be glowing <laughs> in a day or two. Um, but I think I would get a different facial. There was one that had like collagen. It was like a collagen facial. And I think I would do that next time. But anywho, um, felt good to actually get a facial and you know, all the massages and creams, serums, all of that jazz. I did feel very hydrated afterwards with everything that she put on. And then afterwards in the lobby area of the spa, you guys saw I got a piece of toast with some mushroom, sun-dried tomatoes and balsamic glaze. And that was really good. But it was also very small. It was just a single piece of toast with that and um, I'm getting hungry again. It is 1.45 right now. So we divided up, went back to our rooms. Everyone, I think they decided not to get ready. They just kind of threw on their bathing suits and like, yeah, we'll get ready before tonight. Um, I just, I felt gross, so I really wanted to shower because um, all the serums and stuff, she had pushed it back into like the base of my hairline. So also my hair was sticking to get, things just weren't looking cute. So I showered and got fully ready. And then um, they headed down to the beach. The boys just now got back from bowling or bowling, uh, golfing. And so they are in the main room right now. And then I think, I'm not sure if Darren's coming here or if he's, or if we're gonna meet somewhere, uh, waiting for him to text back and we'll determine the plan. Um, last night, I don't feel like I really explained what was going on. So last night was Chris Stapleton. So we did go to the concert and then we, waited for a few songs and we just didn't know any of them as it turns out none of us actually know chris stapleton <laughs> so um got some churros and um just hung out there for a bit we ended up leaving early and then we went bowling um which i you know i shared some clips of and then just came back and went to bed we're gonna head to the beach and pool party in a bit and yeah see you there all right we've had a slight costume change out of the hat switch to a black cover-up because today is pink and black so this is what we're working with we have made it but we're gonna head to the beach we are going for a bit more of a chill day today
We hung out on the beach for a few hours. It was great. Super, super windy today. Uh, my hat keeps flying. Oops. My hat keeps flying off, so now I'm just carrying it. Um, so we're gonna go hang by the pool for a bit and then get ready and go to the concert tonight. And yeah, I'm still upset about the curly fry situation. You best believe when we passed the card again, I took a little peek to see if they got more curly fries, see if they could redeem themselves. They did not. They have let me down once again. I'm mad about it. I feel wronged by Crash My Playa. How do you run out of curly fries? <sighs> Popped in the room real quick to get my ankle brace and my ankle icing thing because my sister-in-law was playing volleyball and she twisted her ankle when she came down on the sand. She had like a pocket of, you know, like in the sand and it twisted her ankle and she heard something pop and things are not going well. And I was like, well, great news. I actually have ankle icing stuff and a little ankle brace. So bringing that to her, we're all still hanging out the pool, but um, making a little pit stop. Getting ready for the nighttime. We've got the shirt on. We are here uh, with the family. I don't think Darren is going to make it. He is hurting for certain after golf today and it's been a settle downhill. So uh, he might be joining us later, but as of right now, he's thinking no, but I'm really excited for tonight. So it's Sierra's birthday tomorrow. So we decorated for her a bit. We brought what we could, but she's about to come out and see it. back to the room and they are all set up. We have the silent disco, ready to rock and roll. DJ's already playing. He is killing it. You can tell he's got the vibe. And then they have a bunch of, oh my god, they have bars every week. And then they have tons and tons of food, tons of waiters. And this is the pool that had the pool party. You can see the stage back there. But we are heading in for the night. We haven't made it to a single after party. I wish, but honestly, we can barely make it through the evenings because it is just... It, they are very long days. I mean, you are starting real early in the morning. You're going all day. You're going back, changing, getting ready for evening, going all night. And then you're going to, what, do the after party till 3 a.m.? I think not. I don't have the stamina for that. Of course, another bar. They just keep it coming, guys. Darren had the best idea. We're going on stage. We're going to see what it's like. Yeah, this palm tree is real intrusive, right in the middle of the stage. Why did they put a palm tree in the middle of this? Well, I think the palm tree was here first, and I think the stage came second. But how cool is this view while you're performing? Minus the palm tree. 